My name is Carrie Flasspoler and I'm the gallery director and I'll be giving you a tour of the current exhibit, Rita Obelario. This exhibit has been extended to October 30th, so if you'd like a private viewing, please email me at gallery at finlandia.edu to set up a time. Let's go inside. The title of the exhibit is Who Am I Without Her? Who Is She Without Us? When my daughter was born, I tracked her growth using drawings and paintings to mark the new warped experience of time. I saw only a few people leaving my home just once a day for a walk. The recently mandated quarantines have forced the same period of social isolation. In quarantine and during the postpartum period, we were asked to stay inside to keep our families safe. With each day bleeding into the next, this has also become a moment to reflect on our new identities and values. Now with a toddler at home, the outside world feels like a shifting backdrop to my baby's developmental leaps. When the first COVID-19 cases were reported, she began to climb. At the start of the statewide lockdown, she began to point. And when the Black Lives Matter protests began, she stood unaided for the first time. Her development as a person and as a part of a new generation is entangled with America's cultural shifts. Now I'll take you on a video tour of the pieces in the exhibit. I'll slowly move through the exhibit so that you can see each piece and uh, I'll give a little explanation of what they're about. The first series of drawings that I'll share with you are drawings that Rita made in the first days and months when the baby was born. These are intimate portraits of a mother and child bonding in the first days of life. These beautifully rendered drawings are an intimate look at the first days of life often created while Rita was breastfeeding, they share that special early moment of a mother and a child. This painting is called Now I Notice All of the Babies and it was done in 2020. It's about the importance of family in Rita's life. Army Crawl, a oil painting on panel was created in 2020. The next series of works were mainly created in 2020 and they take us through vignettes of daily life during the pandemic. They tell us about the moments that we miss, the, the hugs and, and love that we are longing for. They tell us about the poignant moments that Rita stored in her memory to later draw or paint to express those intense emotions of motherhood. Remembered moments where we were free to hug and touch and express our love. This painting's from 2019. But life has changed in a quarantine. And now a grandbaby experiences their grandmother over video. You'll recognize this as a sonogram, and here's a portrait of the newborn baby. This painting is entitled Mother's Shadow, and this is a digital print called Who Am I Without Her? Who Is She Without Me? The title piece of the show. Poignantly, this small, black, dark piece are both the first words of a child 
and the last words that George Floyd spoke. This large digital print is a reflection on what it's like to raise a family during the time of COVID. It's called Family Pods. And here's some details. This piece is titled Clifftivism. And another portrait of Rita's experiences of her first months as a new mother. Rita was living in Chicago at the beginning of the pandemic. This piece is titled, She Can't See Her Grandchildren Anymore. This small painting, oil on panel, is called Chicago Policeman and Protester. Rita's apartment was very close to the unrest that was happening in Chicago at the time. This is a large scale painting entitled Night Walks, and it's about the experience of Rita taking her child out at night in Chicago. This painting is titled For George Floyd and His Mother. Car burning in the Chicago Loop. Who am I now with her? Thank you for joining me on this video tour of Rita Obelario's exhibit. I found her work so inspirational in that she created such beautiful work in such a difficult time and brought both her personal experience and the cultural events of the day together in her work. So please email me at gallery at finlandia.edu to make an appointment to see the show. And please bring a mask.